You may be wondering if you're thinking about studying Spanish here, okay, uh, what do I do during the week? What do I do on the weekends? Well, I can tell you, during the week, it's school. Okay? <laughs> it's four hours a day of yeah. school plus generally, don't want to scare anybody, but there's a lot of homework as well. Yeah. But this is how you learn, this is how you dance. So during the week, uh, up until Friday afternoon, uh, your time is, is fairly occupied. Uh, come Friday afternoon or uh, on the weekends, uh, there's many beautiful beaches very close to here and they're very easy to reach. Uh, of course you can take a taxi or an Uber, uh, but there's also uh, there's two bus stations very close to here. Yeah. And you can just go to the bus station, pay uh, a couple of dollars, buy a ticket and you can be at the beach in an hour. So uh, lots of beautiful beaches that you can visit, uh, which I have done uh, on the weekends. So, Lots to do, and uh, I would highly recommend if you come here that uh, not only you study uh, study here, but also uh, partake uh, in the activities of the school. There's lots of activities in the afternoons. Uh, squeeze those in with your homework. Uh, there's conversation with, with the locals, so they are known as Ticos. Uh, so there's conversation. It's a really safe city. It's very close to wonderful beaches. I thought it was going to be difficult. Uh, you know, to get to the beach, but it turns out it's like a dollar fifty. Uh, it takes about fifty minutes, and you're there, and it's really, really easy. Um, the food has been wonderful here. Mm -hmm. The people are all uh, extremely nice. Um, I don't know. I can't think about. I can't think of a bad thing about uh, Liberia at all. To be Great. honest with you. Um, the, the Club A where you volunteer with some of the local uh, population and try to teach them English. Um, it was a, a fun way to experience the different cultural aspects of how other people live. Um, and then there was the, um, the Spanglish or Intercambio where you have half of your time spent um, speaking in Spanish and half the time speaking in English so that both parties get to practice their opposite language. Um, and that was really fun that I was able to ask different cultural questions um, and learn more about specifically Costa Rica. Uh, so that was fun. And then uh, I've been super interesting, you know, I've learned a lot about the culture, I've learned a lot, obviously a lot about the language. Um, I got to meet new people, see, you know, have totally different experiences. like. All the, uh, you know, the um, the waterfalls were yeah. cool. The, the beaches are beautiful. So it's been really uh, a great experience, for sure.